Women and children first. Okay. So we're all in agreement then. We sell the ship and split the dough. You promised money. Not the tasty combination of water and flour. Quill's just knocked out, you morons. He isn't dead. But I already called dibs on his stuff. <laughs> He's got tons of earth junk in his room. I'm sure that'd fetch you a few units of the trader's market. Thanks, guys. Appreciate the concern. Really. <laughs> oh! Hey, Pete! We were totally looking out for you, man. Your stuff, your legacy, that's real important. It should be sold for as much money as possible. Fair enough. <laughs> I'm not getting back up there. When you're gone, you're gone. to have my jet boots busted. I'll have to find another way out. All right. Talk to Mantis because I think she kind of experienced that flashback up, with us. Oh, hello. Is everything okay? I just wanted to thank you for catching me. Anytime. And I'm sorry for intruding on your memory of your mother. She seemed like a nice woman. Yeah. She was. Alright, that's that. Talk to Drax. Hey Drax, you see any way out of here? I have looked up, I have looked down. I have even turned in a complete circle. There is no exit. Hmm. All right. We'll keep looking. I will not rest until I find that treacherous exit. <laughs> All right, then. What about Rocket? Hey, Rocket. Ah, look. It's our troubled leader, Peter Quill. Just when I think things couldn't get worse, just when I think we've hit rock bottom, you managed to find us something lower. This time, literally. Yeah. Well, I am to please. Not a compliment, but okay. All right, then his salty. Groot. Hey, Groot. You holding up okay? I am Groot. Uh. He says he's thirsty. Uh, okay. What about Gamora and Nebula? There we go. Hey, Gamora. Nebula's really hurt. Maybe beyond repair. I couldn't stop it. This is what happens when someone gets too close to me. I've never seen her this bad before. She's tough, but that may not cut it this time. I know what happened is terrible, but you should be proud of her. We got through to her. That doesn't fix this. We let Nebula into the Guardians and look where it got her. We have to live with that. She'll be fine. Right, hole. Whoa. <laughs> Kill it! Kill it with bullets! Don't tell me you're afraid of that little guy. <laughs> yes, what a ridiculous looking creature. On my world, tunnel worms are filthy. They eat only rock and dirt. Hey, hey, get back. I don't know what this thing is. I can find out its intentions, at least. Mantis, stay away. It's okay. It doesn't want to harm us. It's just... curious. Curious about how we taste, probably. <laughs> is it chewing through that stone? Better that than us. Getting chewed to death is top five on my all-time fears list. Yeah. You're not so bad, are you? Huh. Bioluminescence. Probably how this thing communicates. Or draws in its unwitting quill-sized prey. It wants to stay with us. Maybe we should give it a name. Like a pet. I am excellent at naming things. I shall call it... Uh, blue. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Hungry. No, no. Its name should be obviously a death trap. 
because that's what it is. I like blue. That's not any good. Well, I think the name is extremely appropriate. Blue sounds good to me. Good. It will forevermore be known as blue. Although now it's red. What? Great. The Guardians have a mascot. I am Groove. I'm the co-pilot. I ain't no mascot. <laughs> <laughs> Would you look at that? Blue's a helpful little bugger. He's getting us out of here. Oh, yeah. Wait, wait, wait. No one has a problem with this. The death trap thing was not just some cute expression. It's our only way out, Rocket. <sighs> Putting an I told you so in my pocket for later use. Peter, what about Nebula? <laughs> Come here. Hey, buddy. Can you carry her? I am Groove. It's one worth doing Thanks, it. Groove. The little guy sped off. <laughs> um, okay. It might be a bad alien thing, but who knows? Beautiful. Maybe I wouldn't be so psychically scarred. Look at that. What is that? Pick up? Oh dear. I'm so gonna regret this, aren't I? I am groomed. Whoa, what are you doing, Pete? That crystal there is natural thorium. Just looking at one the wrong way can cause it to explode. Worth a ton of units, but highly volatile. Huh. I'm actually a little surprised no one's mined this planet dry. Maybe there's a reason no one tried. Uh-oh. Um, not good. Kill us. Just eat us. As I said, they're hungry. Like that makes me feel any better. Oh, 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 okay. Look, we're not here to fight. We're friends with Blue. Do you know Blue? Huh? <laughs> not working. Okay. It's pretty cool. Even though the frame rate's a bit bad. Okay, cool. He's right. They just keep coming. I need another plan. I don't know, I like the sound of that. Yeah, no offense, but that statement doesn't usually end up okay for us. Everyone, look out! Oh, yes. Like the smell of fried worms to really lift your spirits. Yes, just like mother's cooking. <laughs> Here we go. Which way? One of these has got to lead us back to Hala. Whoa, 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 whoa! Hold up. You actually want to keep going after Hala? Maybe you were watching a different show 
but in the one I saw, the forge blew up in her face, and she wound up with godlike powers. So, you're okay with being responsible for Hala laying waste to the entire galaxy? Wasn't my idea to try and destroy it. I said it would be bad news. Basically told you exactly what would happen. Boom! Forge in the face, Mega Hala. Magala. We did the right thing. Clearly, no one should be able to have that kind of power. Yeah, great job. Now that power is in her face. The power we could have used to help our loved ones. Which is exactly why we have to go after her. You don't get to talk, Gamora. It's because of you. We got to carry out all this dead weight. She isn't dead. Yet. The word you're looking for is yet. She's as good as, if you ask me. No one did. I know I failed her. I don't need you to twist the knife. Hey, everyone needs someone like me. The guy who says what everyone's thinking, but is too much of a whip to do anything about it. Look, shut up, both of you. We gotta get out of here, and neither of you are helping. No, you shut up, Quill. I'm tired of hearing the sound your, your face is making. Blah, 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 eternity forge. Blah, 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 family. Blah, 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 mom. Where? Shut up! What part of shut up didn't you understand? <laughs> oh, I fully understand. I just chose to ignore it. It's called free will. Dude, <laughs> seriously, take all the things you want to say, wrap them up in a nice neat little box, flush them all down a toilet, and shut the hell up! No thank you. I can tell I'm digging under your skin. You really don't like when people don't listen to you, huh? How many ways do I have to say it? Shut up. Shut up? Shut up! Sparkles in French? Le shut le up! <laughs> Alright, enough already! Sorry. I don't speak, idiot! Yeah, shut up. He lit this fire just to watch us all burn. That's what he wants. No! What I want is to not see your face anymore! Fine by me. Hey, all this? It's your fault, Quill. If you hadn't exploded the forge, I'd have one less thing to be pissed at you for. Yeah, Rocket needs to, uh, kinda do one. Speck in the French. Le shut, let up. <laughs> I am Groot. What? Oh, fine, you big baby. I didn't need any of you when I started in this business, and I don't need you now. Better off on my own. Oh, come on. Gamora. Gamora, wait up. Go with Gamora. I will protect the rodent. Do not worry. The rodent. <laughs> Fair enough. Sometimes I do not need to tell you how the others are feeling. Makes my job easy. Thank you.